Oh, we're here already? Sweet. Oh, I don't want to lose all... I can make it back pretty easily. Two or three trips through this place learning that that much. Alright, give me a moment. Sorry, I had to crack my thumb. Big Roy, let's do it, dude. Old hero should start right here. You know, it's weird. It looks like his body's on fire. So... Oh, should I really have turpentine equipped? Because it seems like he's going to be able to find me no problem. Alright, Big Roy, run. He, He's heard me. He is aware of my presence. This is not as good as it could be. At least he gets stunned. Big Roy, move. How did you get... This is not fair! Okay, move, 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 move. Roll. Roll your sorry ass away. God damn. This is fine. It's just two sorry souls. You know? You know what I'm saying? Of course you do. Wait, that really should have hit me. I'm not gonna try and claim that I was perfectly fine. I was within the sword's hitbox. I know this. Alright, you. Man, that's that's actually very reminiscent of Quaylog, now that I think about it. The way he does that. I don't care, I've got more full moon grass than anything. I know I should save it, but at the same time... Don't care enough. Okay, that one I can understand because I was right between his legs. That sounds wrong. You know what, fuck it. Gonna roll back, we're gonna heal again. There we go. You ready, Big Roy? We can finish this guy off. No problem. I hope. I Man, shouldn't be problematic. Ah, I timed that perfectly. One could say I turpentined! See, I love being able to do this solo because nobody can yell at me for my puns until it's posted. And then, even then, it's a bit late. Wouldn't you say? Woo! I don't know how I dodged that, but fuck it. Okay, that one makes more sense. That one makes complete sense that I would get hit by that. Alright, you. Bring it on. You know, I just noticed you don't really have lips. Not like the Angelina Jolie scenario. But like, you legit don't have lips. They're gone. It's just your teeth are showing. They're exposed, so to speak. I don't know what that voice was there, but... Hey, you're done. Yay, I did things. Fog wall is over there. Weird that this wasn't... Weird that it was just a normal fog wall as opposed to a white one there, but... Hey, it works. Got another trophy. This is a productive episode. Footsteps. Oh, he was blind. So maybe I wasn't too far off when I thought of that with Seath. Cool. I'll take that Dark Moonstone. Interesting that the Reaper died. Take that full moon grass. Was there anything else here? Oh, there's loot over there. It's not safe here. Uh, I need to check that message rating. Although that would totally make sense, given that uh, there's a reaper here. Oh, well, I mean, if there's an archstone. Hero, demon, soul. All right. Another fog wall already? Oh boy. 
Uh, do we want to try the sticky white stuff or the black turpentine? I have no idea what's coming, so I think sticky white stuff first. <laughs> Alright, Big Roy, you ready? You know, in hindsight, the turpentine may have been the better option. Use arrows. I don't have that many arrows! I can't do that! Oh no! What What do I do? Down. Fuck you! I know... Oh my god, there are so many of them! <laughs> in hindsight, turpentine. I don't care. I don't care. Let's just... Let's just... Work our way th Actually, you know, do I still have that grave robber's ring on me? I had that thought. No, oh, let's see, clean ring. Curse it. No, I doubt it. Okay. Let's just get down there. I have no idea how I would fight this, but that's fine. Challenge the storm, you will need a sword that can rend the sky. Safe place. Bullshit! I'm calling bullshit right now. New moon grass. Heh. Heh. So, what I need is something. Beware of the message ahead. Helpful. So many of you huge bastards. This is fine. There's valuable treasure ahead. Patches, you fucker, don't leave messages here. I don't even know how you got in and out. Where's the boss? Next enemy's weakness is during its attack. There's a crystal lizard here. This is fine. Savage. Use slash attacks on the next enemy. Oh! Storm Ruler! Am I going to be safe here? Yeah. Let me switch over to Storm Ruler. Let's see, where is it? A legendary large sword with a thorny blade named for one who calms storms. It is said the ancestors of the Shadow Men rendered the storms and clouds in the sky with it. Now abandoned, with much of its power lost, it is an average large sword. However, if it is used in the monolith forest where ancestral spirits slumber, you may be able to reawaken its ancient power to rend the sky. Big Roy, I'm sorry, I know that we have to... Oh, dude! Fuck yes! 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 This is beautiful! I like this sword! You know what? Fuck you. You earned that. Do I have grindstones on me? I might need them. At least if I'm right. How's the durability on this thing looking now? Oops. Oh, durability's only 10. Okay, well, looks like I'm doing right then. Let's see. Oi! I said! It doesn't feel too good, does it? Hmm. No, 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 no. Doesn't feel good having all the air you suck in just shot right back at you. Now does it? Assholes. All y'all are assholes. What do you drop, anyway? Cloudstone. Cool. Nope. Okay, this may take a minute or two. But that's fine. How did I kill him? I did. Okay. I'm actually killing these guys. Weird that I feel so 
good about that. Probably shouldn't, on reflection. They are majestic creatures, but they're still a pain in the ass. Oh, did I just get a twofer? I did. Aw, oh, yeah. Big Roy, you and this sword are good friends. Whoop. Oh, did I get it? I get it. I got it. That's what I'm trying to say, and I can't say it for some reason. This is a little bit tedious, isn't it? Yeah, it still looks awesome. I mean, look at this. I am using sonic... I'm using air. Just blasts of air to deal with these things. And it's working out wonderfully. I'll take that cloudstone. I will take whatever you have here. Chunk of cloudstone, okay. What is this music? Oh, hello, mothership! Uh, where? Oh. Oh, dude. You know what? Enjoy, because I'm going to make sure your babs just suffer. You understand? Look what you've done. You did this, sir! I mean, I assume you're a male because it says Storm King. Storm Beast really should not be this large. Also, those barbs. Not at all pleasant to look at. I'll take this cloudstone, though. Or not. You know, don't worry about me too much. God, why do you have so many Lovecraftian tentacles? Whoa. Whoa, whoa. Sir. Sir, your children. Sir. Take that. Uh, maybe if I do that? How do I fight you? How exactly do I attack you? I would love to know. God, you're so majestic. But I have to kill you. You are a terrible, terrible creature. Consider this comeuppance for everything that your children did to me on the way here. I mean, it's only fair, right? I got a hit off on him. That's a start, at least. I'll grab this before I go back and try for the other stuff. So many stones and such. I have to get around over there, because there's a loop there. Do do do. Do do do. Run, my man, run! Getting there, getting there. Oh, yeah. Man, that just does not look healthy. No matter who you are or what you are. Try it again. Try again. Big Roy. I see, that is a massive stamina drain. Oh, that... That looked painful. I mean, the sound he made also sounded like it really hurt. It's cool, though. We're making progress. There we go. Do it again! Kill this monstrosity! Bring it down! Make the Monster Hunter family proud! I didn't even play Monster Hunter. I don't know, it just never caught my interest. Oh man, we're so close. Is this really how big Storm Beasts can get? Because, I don't know, the ones flying around in 4-2 seemed kind of... They seemed kind of like, you know, adult-sized and stuff. Also, it was mentioned to me that I'm actually above the clouds on this island. Which confuses me, given that, uh, you know, it looks like water. Could very well not be, but that's neither here nor there, I suppose. Alright, Big Roy, do it to it. One more should do it. Or two or three more. Dodoria, two or three more. Two or three more, two or three more. I wonder if I aim for the wings or the tail, does that actually hamper him at all? Like, would he touch down and 
you know, not be able to fly anymore. It'd be mighty convenient, admittedly. Alright, get under the thing. Okay, two more should do it. You got this. And down he goes. Aw oh, yeah. Represent, Big Roy. Oh, there's the Archstone right over there. Alright, I need to check some... Oh, -ho, we are leveling up something fierce. Just need to make sure, like... That looks like water to me. Also, damn, this island is huge after all. Alright. Storm Ruler, you are a brilliant, brilliant sword. However, Big Roy has faith in the axe. And since your power is depleted and your durability is kind of shit. That was excellent, though. Like, that was an amazing fight. I like that. That was really cool. Well done, FromSoft. I did not expect that. Storm Demon Soul and Pure Cloudstone. All right. Thomas, I have things for you. But before we do anything, I need to read through the lore on this. Okay. After purification, Hero's remains are offered to the Storm King. His wings cover the sky, and he is accompanied by storm beasts. Now, see, if I had read that, I wouldn't have been as, take as surprised. You guys should have seen my face. It was like, ha 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 Like a huge flying stingray, the Storm King is the embodiment of the thoughts of Shadow Men from hundreds of years ago. Cool. All right, Thomas first. Think hard. Yep. Oh, God. God, I'm kind of sad that was over. Like, that whole area was basically fun from start to finish. Hello again, Thomas. Thank goodness you are safe. I was worried sick about you. You don't need to worry too hard about Big Roy, dude. I have some Cloudstone for you. Let's take the clear stone. And let's see. Take Storm Lord. And a compound bow. And I guess that's it. If only I could. Dude, you are we doing are plenty. To you, for you fight on our behalf. That was just a I fun fight. Fun. I don't care. Like, I would have thought it'd be kind of like the Minish Cap, where you have to get on top of the uh, giant stingray things that are flying through the air, and then attack their eyes, but no. Dude, that was just awesome start to finish. Just, ugh. Still geeking out about it. And what, what are the world tendencies up to? Okay, they're pretty close to what they need to be. I really wonder what's up with the broken arch stone. Is that DLC? Might be. Hello, dear. Thou seek then you know it full well I seek soul power. Uh, let's do another luck. Another endurance. Another vitality. Another strength. And one more endurance for good measure. Art thou done? Main thine... Strength, help the world be mended. Yes, dear. Alright, let's get back to the palace. We have things to explore. Oh, is that loot? Or is that another candle? That's the candle again. Saint Urbane, you... Sorry. Actually, I want to get loot on some of these souls I have. Freak. Freak, where you be, man? Got so much to do. Like, I may finish this far quicker than I did... Demon or uh, Dark Souls. Bravo! Thank. You. Let me. I am one hour human. I probably skipped through new things, but that's fine. Let's learn some spells. Okay. Uh, Armor Spider Soul, Dragon Soul. Okay. Greatly strengthens right hand weapon. Used with Catalyst equipped in left hand. Ah, cool. Symbolizes the Penetrator's gigantic sword. Her her. Uh, let's see. What am I looking for? That was made in Astraea's soul. Oh, well, interesting. I don't have anything. I am fully prepared. Yes, Freak. Uh, maybe I can get some lore from the souls themselves. Let's find out. Okay, Vanguard. Radiant Strong Power. Demon made in Astraea. Dirty Colossus. Storm King. Yeah, nothing new. Okay. That is fine. Alright. Anyway. Now we faffed around a little bit. 
Let's get back through the penetrator archstone. Actually... Uh, we need to go back through to... Well, he's still fighting it. We need to go back to where the first Red-Eyed Knight was. I have an idea. The door was locked, and I don't know why, but I have a feeling the set of iron keys will help us with that. Let's go check it out. I've probably missed so much lore in this world, and I'm not certain, quite honestly. Nope. Okay. So, I still can't get through this door. That is fine. I think. Nope, I just can't open it for whatever reason. Maybe world tendency isn't close enough to pure white or pure black? I don't know. Actually, I was told that that door opens at pure white or pure black. But beyond that, I am at a loss for what to do there. Because honestly, I could just run through these guys. Why do I insist on fighting them? Easy Moongrass. That's probably the most logical explanation. Hey! See ya. Hey! I wish I could have parried that. Hello! Wow, you missed terribly, dude. That was right in front of you, too. Yeah. There we go. Oh, hi! I get a chance at redemption. And I botched it horribly. Stop that. Beware of your item burden ahead. Yeah, that's fair. That is totally fair. There we go. Problem solved. Alright, so to the Red-Eyed Knight then. These guys are a good source of turpentine, incidentally. I mean, if you're doing a lot of off-camera grinding like I tend to do, it's going to happen. And of course, it's Crescent Moongrass instead of turpentine. You're making me out to be a liar. I don't like you for that. But I'm so frightened. Like, I've made a crazy amount of headway. It's it's weird. I didn't realize it was that far down. Damn. But just think about it. The past couple of sessions, we have done nothing but blaze through every single challenge. I mean, yeah, the swamp was a pain in the ass, but past that, we've been doing pretty good. I would... I mean... Can I really say anything else on it? We have done well. You know, you guys have stuck with me. I hope. I don't know who all is going to be watching this. I know at least one person will be. Hello! Hello, uh... Where's my gesture? Wave. Hi! How's it going? Anyway. I don't normally parry that. But as I was saying, I do appreciate it if you've stuck with me thus far. Take a step forward. Oh, there's loot down there! Why well, you not? Know Fuck it. Let's grab it. Crossbow. Okay. That's a good way to grab it. Uh, do I have to go up? Oh, that's how I get to you. Neat! Alright, I'm just gonna continue up this way. Because if I don't, then, uh, you know. Stop that. Stop, 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 stop lighting me on fire. Take that grass. Take that slave shield. Lovely. Could have done without that, admittedly. It's fine. We'll go up the stairs. We'll go out and around. God, it's been a while since I went this way, hasn't it? No turpentine yet, but that's fine. These guys die pretty easily. We started over there. We're over here now. I like that, you know, in these games, if you can see something, odds are you can get to it. That's just good design in my book. Beware of a trap ahead. Yeah, that's the boulder. Oh, hey, we're back up where we were. Convenient. You know, that's twice now I have missed something because I haven't looked down a ledge. Turns out there was a bonfire in Sense Fortress I could have used. But I didn't find that until it was pointed out to me, and even then, I didn't use it until New Game Plus. Oh dear. Alright, enough of that. A few. 
If this turns out to be a bust, I'll just cut back to when we get back to the Penetrator Archstone. Whew, I'm lightheaded. Alright, you. You ready? Come here. I will wreck you. I will slap your shit. If God had not wanted your shit slapped, he would not have created me. Umbasa. I'm what you'd call the militant, or the faithful militant. All right, see you back at the penetrator archstone. Militant faithful, I think it, it sounds better. Uh oh. No one saw anything. 2100 souls even! Count them! Yeah! Totally! Didn't even fall to my death or anything! Nope! I don't know what you're talking about! You get your head out of your ass right now, misters! Or missus! Whatever you may be. Why are there so many archers? What the? Puff. Puff, I'm sorry. There are black phantoms. I see that there are black phantoms. I don't appreciate that there are black phantoms. Especially since I'm not going to be able to lure them one at a time knowing my luck. Actually, maybe I can. Just got to be careful not to get much closer. I don't have the ring I need for what I want to do there, so let's just grab you. Grab you. Let's see what's over here. Nothing. Alright. Let's see. We'll put a message here. Oh, I'm so sorry for you, dude. I like your design, though. I like how you've got the whole beak thing going. That's neat. Very interesting. But, you know, me, crows, ravens, just really any kind of bird-related death I like for some reason. So, okay. Black Phantom 1. Step up to the plate. Come on. I need you back here. So that I may fight you one on one. Tally ho! Get back here. Come on. Do I have to backstab a bitch? Is Big Roy gonna have to choke a bitch? Big Roy gonna have to choke a bitch. Rip. What do you have for me, though? Penetrating sword. So the penetrator is more than just is just more than one person. A long straight sword used by the penetrator, one of the heroes of Boletaria. As the name states, its thrusts are especially powerful. Because of its irregular size, for a straight sword, it requires great strength and technique. Yeah, that would make sense for more decks. So basically, it's like Sephiroth's Masamune. Or whatever. However the sword is said. I don't, I don't know. It's like nine feet long. Does does the name really factor in when you can just call it Sephiroth's sword and everybody knows what it is? Are you done? Yeah, you know, I'll deal with the guy with the shield first. At least him I know what I'm getting into. As soon as he gets over here, of course. He is coming. He is coming. Give him time. Just lure him in. Lure him back away from the archer. Oi! Oi, get back here! Come on! Ugh! I need you. I need your sweet, sweet booty. Come on. Back here. Straight line. Straight line. Follow me. Follow me. Come on. This way. Just keep us away from your friend there with the bow and arrow. And we'll get through this, okay? There we go. I just need you back a little bit further. That looks like the Spear of the Phalanx shot out at us. What's going on there? Also, you look like a very tiny tower knight. 
How did Tower Knight get so huge, anyway? Was it just like a scaling issue? No, that seems like it was on purpose. Well, it doesn't really matter now. Ow. Holy shit. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna back up this way. You're gonna come with me. I hope. And I'll just... You know, brutally murder your friend. Yeah. That sounds... Ow, 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 ow. Okay. Your friend can live for now. I promise. I'm lying. I don't want him to live. Alright, one more backstab should do it. I am not about to parry this guy because... That's going to end badly if I do. Oh, wow. I do less damage to this guy than I thought. And again, that's to be expected. Still, he's dead now. That's a plus. And black phantoms don't respawn. Hey, a tower shield. Okay. So if I use the tower shield and the penetrator sword... That's some... I, don't, I can't even come up with any kind of smush name for that. Alright. Come on. No, you don't. Oh, I see. Now you have a weapon out. Oh, look at you, Mr. or Mrs. Brave. Aren't you cocky? Uh-huh. Bet you I can kick your ass. Come on. Come on. You and me. You and me. Since you're not a player, I'm just gonna do that. And we're gonna fight. You and me. Fight to the death. Come on. Bring it. Bring it. Ready? Ready? I honestly probably could have just gotten away with, you know, parrying there. But I didn't think about it. Doing good, doing good. Come on. You got this, Big Roy. Okay. You got a little carried away there. And you're bleeding. You're dead, but you're bleeding. 